Hi guys. So today I'm going to show you how to solve an easy and simple al algorithm. The question is implement an algorithm to determine if a string has all unique characters. So this question is coming directly from the book Cracking the Coding Interview by Gil Leekman McDowell, 6th edition. Alright, so this is the first question. So my goal is basically to solve as many questions as possible and to show you guys how to do it using JavaScript. Which, which obviously is much easier. Alright, so here's my steps. I'm basically going to take the string, turn it into an object, and then count the values to see if any of them is over 1. If they are over 1, then I would return false. If they are not over 1, I'll return true. But it's a very simple question and something you can possibly get. Alright, so let's begin. Const, I'm going to call it is unique. Hopefully you can see what I'm um, doing is unique. I'm, I'm using ES6 by the way. If you do not know how to use ES6, please watch my other videos on how to use ES6. Okay, is unique. And then the next thing I'm doing is I'm taking the string, turn it, in, it into an object. So let me make an object. Const object, an empty object. Then after I've made an empty object, the next thing I should do is I'm going to loop create a loop that would allow me to loop through the strings loop let i of string so i'm going through the string and i'm going to do a one line if else statement i know it has a name but i forgot the specific name so forgive me for that okay so so i'm checking if let's see if if the let's see if the object i does not exist so if there is nothing inside the object, obviously set it to one. I mean, so I'm setting I'm setting that to one. If there is something inside the object, then I'm just gonna increment the value. That's it. So actually, we can even we can print this to the screen now. Let me show you. Let's print this to the screen. Actually, return return object. Let's let's um, print the object to the screen so you can see how it looks like. So I'm going to call it console.log is unique. Then let me pass let me pass uh Bab Academy. Then that's that's the name of my channel. Obviously you can see it has two Bs and three A's, so this is not unique. But let's see what let's see what this prints us on the screen right there. So node test See, I get two B's, as you can see, three A's, and everything else is one. So I'm basically writing an algorithm to check if any of this is over one. If it is, if if any of the character is more than one, then I'm going to return false. It is not unique. If they are all one, then I return true. So obviously this is false. So I'm going to show you how I'm going to do that. So I'm going to create a, another loop. So I can count the values. This time I'm going to say let i in object. So so let i in object. I'm going to say if if let's see if object i is greater than one return true. I mean return false. And then if it is not return true. So the example that I have. Here should definitely return false. So let's see, false. Beautiful. So that's it. It's very simple. Let's let's choose something that is true. K U N L E. This should return true. True. That's it. So here's a simple algorithm. All it does is basically it checks to see if a string that you intake is um is unique or not. Thank you.